at uh, the Community Charter Fair 2023. Before I hand over the award, I just want to say a few words to put the whole thing into context. Volunteering your time to support a cause you are passionate about is something you will never regret. It will enrich your life, familiarise you with your community and connect you to people and ideas that will positively impact your perspective for the rest of your life. Helping your community is an opportunity for you to grow as a person, to better understand how you fit into the world around you. It's amazing the amount of people here today and somebody's just commented on how many more stalls there are this year than there were last year, which is great and everyone's really colourful. They've got the bunting out, they've got the flags out and everything, it's, it's amazing. And I think, um, because everyone has gone to loads of trouble outside the main town council marquee all around the Millennium Green and I believe there are things going on in uh, Bakidu as well and the music is fantastic. Hi there, this is um, all the exhibition for the Discovery Centre which is located in West Bay. Uh, it opened in 2018 having previously been the Methodist Chapel. We have many exhibitions that run. Um, our opening times are from Tuesday through to Sunday from 11 o'clock till 4 o'clock in the afternoon. Uh, love to see you and if you fancy volunteering we'd also love to see you. Okay. Uh, I'm a member of Story Traders and we've written, this is our second anthology and we've donated 30 copies to Harmony um, and all the proceeds from them will go to them. Hi, Hi I'm Hayley from the West Country Business Trust. Uh, we're here today with our lovely stall, educating people on uh, your local rivers, your history, mythology related to rivers. We have a lovely book here, History of the Brit, um, Christchurch Dragon, which flew over a river. Um, we're doing um, pe inviting people to come and write poems about their local rivers. We're going to have some invertebrate ID and some storytelling later as well. Thanks. <laughs> yes, Hat Festival, 2nd of September. Wear a hat, win a prize. We are for the Living Tree, which is a cancer support group for local people in Bridgeport. We have lots of activities going on and Fridays we have an afternoon meet in the Quaker rooms between 2 and 4 o'clock. Anybody's welcome to come with us. Ah, Hello. Just wonder if you're interested in the work of the Wildlife Trust. We're here to conserve our natural world and enhance biodiversity. Sadly, we are one of the most wildlife depleted countries in the world. You've perhaps seen our patron, Sir David Attenborough, on TV recently talking about the, the dire situation for the British Isles. Um, we have one in seven of our species that are now sadly close to extinction, including the poor little hedgehog who is uh, one of the, the seven and uh, sadly we might need to go to a zoo to see them in four years time. But yes, we've lost a vast amount of our wild flower meadows and ancient woodlands and great stretches of hedgerow. The good news is here in Dorset we have 40 plus reserves, all nature rich places spread throughout the whole county so that nature can move around, migrate, mix up the gene pool and today we're just hoping that some of you might come and join. Hello, I'm from Girl Guiding and we are the leading charity for girls and young women in the UK. We've been giving these girls and young women opportunities and adventures for over 100 years. So come and join us. Hello, I'm Heather. I run Report Youth, youth Club. I'm the lead youth worker. Uh, we have three youth clubs. We have the juniors, we have younger seniors and we have older seniors. And we do these youth clubs on a Wednesday and Friday evenings.